Chowchilla Navid Asterisk Tally will have a chance to play in this year's United States Women's Open Golf Championship, and she'll tackle her first major at the ripe old age of 15. The teenage phenom, and pay attention to her because she's going to be something, earned a spot in the U.S. Open during today's qualifier at Fresno San Joaquin Country Club. Tally, a two-time drive, chip, and putt national finalist, was five under par for 36 holes today. The top finisher was six under. The top two get automatic berths in the U.S. Open. Tally was steady all day. She got out of trouble on 18 after a key birdie on 17, and she is on her way to play in the United States Women's Open. Um, it's definitely hasn't sunk in yet. You know, I'm still like reminiscing on the last hole. It was super scary because I went like way to the right and I was in the long grass and I pulled it. I almost went in the hazard and then I ended up getting up and down for par and it was just like a super scary hole and I knew what I had to do and then the, the birdie on 17 was really good for me and then I just feel like on 18 I knew what I had to do and I ended up doing it. Are you allowing yourself yet to, to think ahead that you're going to be playing in the United States Women's Open? <laughs> Not really. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely going to be thinking about it tonight and for the next couple weeks, obviously. Um, I think I'm going to just try and do my best and keep playing the game that I have been all, all year and my best game. Tally could be the youngest player in the field at 15. Former Fresno State player Harriet Lynch also has reason to celebrate. She finished at three under par. That means She's qualified for one of the two alternate spots. If another golfer cannot compete for whatever reason, Lynch could grab that spot. The U.S. Women's Open begins on May 30th at the Lancaster Country Club in Pennsylvania. It will be the 79th Women's Open. My thanks to San Joaquin Country Club and head club professional Jordan Burton. She and her staff helped us cover this event today, and this was a feather in the cap for San Joaquin Country Club, one of the only four host sites for qualifiers in the state of California. The Reedley College men's golf team has won the NorCal Regional Championship for the second year in a row. The Tigers advance to the state championships next week in Santa Barbara. Hi, I'm Monty Torres with Fox 26 News on YouTube. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel where we have loads of great content for you to choose from. And while you're here, why not click on the subscribe button right here? That way you can stay in touch with all the latest breaking news, everything news related within the Central Valley. And thank you for watching.